All right, everyone, welcome to week six. So to start off this week, we've got class workshop number three. So if you remember back in week one, you signed up for a workshop, you can go back to week one and click on that and see what day you signed up if you need to. So if you signed up for class workshop number three, your draft was due the previous Saturday night before this workshop. And so, so that was due on Saturday. Everybody else is going to come on here and work and post feedback on those workshop drafts by Tuesday night. So if you're in this workshop, you should have already posted. You can find out if it was, if you signed up for it by going back to week one. Everybody else by Tuesday night will come and comment on those drafts. And they're short stories, so they're longer than the poem. So there's only two people being critiqued this week on each board. So because they're longer and there's only two people, I'm still expecting you to go in there, read it thoroughly, and give them some quality feedback. Everyone's working on that for Tuesday night. You're also all working on your short stories. So everybody should be writing their short stories, developing those, getting that first draft finished up in preparation for Thursday night. Those of you participating in workshop number four, you'll need to post your drafts on the workshop four discussion board by Tuesday night. So if you're going to be critiqued in workshop number four, post your drafts by Thursday night, or excuse me, by Tuesday night. Post your drafts by Tuesday night. Everyone will be workshopping you from Wednesday to Thursday night. So uh, then we'll have class workshop number four for Thursday. Everyone should participate in providing feedback. Everyone then will post a draft of their short story to this small group critique board. So again, like we did with our poetry unit, you're going to be in smaller groups critiquing one another so everyone gets feedback that initial post with your draft of your short story for everybody in the class will be due by Thursday night on this board. So make sure you post that so you get some feedback on your short story. That feedback is very valuable. By Saturday night, you're going to go back to this group critique board and comment on all of your peers' stories. You should be in groups of three or four. You're also going to work on your short story some more because it will be due the following Tuesday. So I've given you some re readings about revision that will help you as you're revising. You're also going to get feedback from your peers. So our main priorities priorities this week, class workshop number three, class workshop number four, finishing up your story and posting it on that small group critique board and giving your peers feedback. Those are the main things that are due, so we'll focus on that. Now I want to give you a little pro tip here. These little arrows next to the modules can collapse. So if you're having a hard time because you got to scroll down to week six every time and there's all these other modules, you can go back to this little arrow and collapse the previous week modules so you don't have to see those. You just jump straight to week six. That's a useful thing to avoid being overwhelmed. Now another quick plug, if you are facing any kind of emergencies, if you need mental health help, if you need housing or food help, you know, things come up, life happens. Even while you're in school, you know, things are going to be coming up. If you need resources, please reach out to me or reach out to the appropriate agencies that can help you. I can connect you. I can't give you all that help myself, but I'll tell you who to talk to. I'll point you in the right direction. If you need counseling, if you need assistance of any sort, I can guide you in the right direction. I can be a support for you in that way. I'm also a certified mental health first aid responder, so I can I can help you know what to do if you need to reach out to somebody. I'm not a therapist myself, but I, I do know how to get you in touch with the right people, and I'm here to support you. I want you to be well. I want you to be successful. I care about all of you, so please don't hesitate to reach out or to reach out to the, the agencies in the community or at CBC that can help you. There's lots of people here that are in your corner that can help you out, so don't hesitate to do that. Also, class-related questions, feel free to reach out to me. I hope that you're trying to strike a balance here. You're not working too hard. You're staying up with your work, but you're also taking time to, to do, you know, the things that you need to, to to stay healthy, physically healthy and mentally healthy. I know this part of the quarter, you know, we start to get overwhelmed. It's halfway through, but we can definitely make it through this. We've got a lot to look forward to. So hopefully you're enjoying this class and this is adding some enjoyment to your life. That's the idea. This is meant to be a fun class. So please try to enjoy it and uh, reach out if you need anything. Take care.